I suppose phone hacking matters to journalism students in particular, people who see themselves having a career in journalism, matters because um, it's about a healthy newsroom environment, it's about a healthy industry. So if you want to be a journalist, you want to be a journalist uh, in, a, in a good industry and you do not want to be a journalist in a sick industry where criminality is, is, is tolerated. I think we're building up to when the public inquiry really gets rolling. I think that's when we start to really kick in and, and start to um, uh, drive, I, I hope, drive public interest towards it. Now, why do I say that? The, the press, the news media generally, will cover a public inquiry when it's most interesting to them, when, they, when there's a sensational witness or a sensational development. But they won't maintain a consistent interest. And very often, that's when you lose the most valuable and interesting things. So I, I would like to think that Hacked Off can, can keep attention, draw attention back when it, when, it's, when it otherwise wouldn't be there. There's plenty of stuff on the Guardian website, on our Hacked Off website, um, on other, other sites online following it closely. Follow um, Hackgate on Twitter and Hacked Off on Twitter. Uh, those are good lines where, where you'll pick up the latest stories and be linked to, to, to the latest. Go to some of these events as well. Uh, we had one here tonight, there's one at The Guardian tonight. The, uh, there's, there's something virtually every night of the week um, in which people are talking about the future of journalism. And blog about them. Because Blogging about them helps the public understand you're spreading the word. And then tweet that you've blogged and make people read your blog. So when you read news of all sorts in the newspapers, I think it's a good idea to ask yourself, was this acquired, do I think this was acquired ethically? That's to say, um, has somebody been bullied, cheated? Is there a victim in this story? Is somebody being mistreated? Is the presentation of this story honest? You, the bare facts may be honest, but you may be, begin, be given a, 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 a rather dramatic twist to it. So be a critical reader of the newspapers. And the pressure of critical readers will make journalists more virtuous.